prepared to hand it all over, that's what I said in the Marae today, I've come to give it back from what Mohi Manukau put together and with Te Rawaikato Whare Here Here Manukau in 1820 in Edinburgh put the title there to sell this country with Ongihika. So those two chiefs is what I'm all about with native land title, <coughs> commercial, everything of all the memorials in the world is come under this blueprint Whakamininga and that Whakaputanga flag. On the 1834 side is a land title that belongs to you that no one has owned up on the Seneca Trust which means I'm standing saying fact that no one is going to oppose. And that's my message to you and the old guys. They're the ones that lead the charge. We're the ones with the documents. There's not only me, there's others with documents, but effective documents. Now Tupi's got documents that are effective. He's using them as doing both jobs. So I've got documents that are hitting the nerves of the crown, calling yourself a crown, like that. So mm -hmm. if you think you can play the, that game, you have to go in to pull it out and destroy it. And that's what we're doing. <coughs> we're using your mana to make money out of at your expense. So what I'm doing is putting the mirror in front of them and mirror them back to us, because that's what they did with the mirror, the man in the mirror, to uh, take all your titles and put it on pieces of paper above the land and control it with just bits of paper. And so we're doing the same with paper only to them. Now, I'm saying this. The question was asked, what do we do? Occupy? No, no, no. Documents? It's the other way. Cleanly, clean cut, hand it to them. That's what I did with the writ warrant today. I'm, I'm the author of a writ warrant in our own way of writing. We block letters and mix them up. No one writes like that. And so, see where that goes. See where a piece of paper that we fashion in our own way, native way, and so we're native and stand there and claim that trust as being, I got some documents that look like yours, I think you've got a problem because where do you get your money from? You see? So that's what I'm doing, uh, by me, especially uh, anyway. He's the key. He's the key. With all this commerce, that they've made that much money in 183 years of that flag, it was given to the chiefs, paramount, that's what Mohi said, call yourself a paramount, because it's equal to a king, right? He has the same rights as a king in that <coughs> realm, in, in that game. It's a game. It's a game of Asia. So if you do that, that's what we're questioning out, and with Manahi as being on the 1831 birth certificate title on the Whakawhitira Native Court in Mount Higarani between there and Tiki Tiki, the St. Mary's Church forms the basis of the first birth certificate born on the stock market that King William IV set up in New York. Now that started from that church. The church was responsible for the birth, death, marriage certificate. Everything is certificates. So the brainchild of that was Edinburgh and the Scottish Freemasons. That's what Mohi Manaka won't tell anybody. He swore to secrecy. Don't tell anybody the secret. And he told me, and I told everybody, you're going to get your head blasted off. Because now you know, everybody knows, I'm not the only one that's going to get my head blasted off for letting out the bank secret. The biggest bank secret was the fact that the documents were put together and Prince Philip was the commander-in-chief, not the chief commander. He's the chief commander here, in our world. We're telling them, we have our world, where did you get yours from? You see? If they got it from a native blueprint that anybody's ancestors put together. You see? So they signed those documents that are fashioned in our own way. 
in plain English <coughs> so that they can understand. Now, they'll balk at it because it's real, because the deeds of truth is thicker. Saying the truth, they've got a problem with the truth. So that's, that's what my message is. I don't know you got tomorrow with the hui. I'm here till the end of it. Sure We're staying in the hotel because it's all booked out of here with all cyclists. Got the motel, so uh, we, we got a hotel in, in, in uh, uh, Ohoa Highway. Ohoa. We stay there and we come back. If the hui's going to carry on tomorrow, we're there. We continue the, the, the story. I'm saying not for myself, but because I'm down in Nantipura with our, 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 our chief over there, our, our, well, I'll say he's a, a spiritual side of that church. The church holds the live title. The flag holds the dead title. Two different things in commerce. Right? So the church has the first title, Mohi Manukau's birth certificate from Britain was 1830. The church opened it up and registered those first names into Whakawhitira Native Court. The other Native Courts was Okeato uh, at uh, Russell, Kororareka, and then it shifted to Awaroa, Helensburg, the Manaka title. The, 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 the Māori Māori Manukau title, then you have the Cook title, the James Cook. Those two, the British won't look at anything else on those particular money-making ventures. Over this native, for all the other natives waiting, they're waiting for Māori. They always say, oh, they're waiting for Māori. When, when, when are they going to happen? It's going to happen right now. Because the Paramount Chiefs have got some bits of paper that they can do something. So I'm right behind anything. Anyone that's married is going to protect his land any way he wants. So long as someone's doing that job, I'm going to, I'm going to handle that bank problem that uses instruments over the land with their bits of paper. I'm going to take this paper and throw them off and put it back where it was because the new world order is going to find another trick for another 183 years. So we're going to get them before they get us. And that's why Peter Paroni put the New Zealand wars on the other side so that he says no one's using that admiralty ship. He's got a pinch to that. And because the trustees are moving over there, it's going straight into the Hinaki for these paramount chiefs. They're going sing, sing, sing them out. Sing them out and sting them with the bell. We got the instruments. We got the legal instruments to do everything. There were, the Tupunas left the instruments, the power note, the flag, and other documents that you've got. All you have to do is go and force them. Force, force the documents and make them work in today's world. And, and I, I say, oh, I'll get the money to those ones. They'll give it back to me. You see? That's how it works. Otherwise, how the hell are they going to know what's in my head? See? I'm going to come here and tell you. Oh, here it is. You can book it in the bank there. That's what I've been trying to say all these years, and it goes out the other side. And boy, he says, You don't listen to that one, you listen to me. I said, No, I'm listening to Matsutawa. He said, Decoration of war, decoration of war. Said, well, that's what they fans is a decoration of war. They make money, cause a war, then go and seize it with one British government to whoop the whole lot out and put a British title in. That's what their flag's for. In this way, it wasn't for. The Declaration of Independence has been cancelled by this New South Wales government. You got no money. So start making the flag 1834 and see if that works. Bet you it will work. It will work. You just switch it, say, oh, switch around the other side. See? And tell them, we're going to force them. You know, I'll tell you right now, with confidence, they can't do a damn bloody thing about it. Because now they know Courtman, Chickney, they Chickney. Just like you say, it, 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 it's either the monkeys are on the other side, the way he said, the monkeys, but I'm just saying, they are playing the game as if we're the monkeys. That flag is a pirate flag for two party, your party, and British. Two party, third party, anybody else play with the flag is going to get what with that Admiralty flag because it was two way contract, everything commercial contract. With a flag, 
Anybody in the way? Shoot it. Shoot it. Off the land. And that's what we're doing. We're going to occupy, take it over by instruments from this paramount chief. So that's, 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 that's my little message. I brought my, my, my nephew, Desmond. He's very passionate about uh, Maori. Call yourself what you want. I call myself <coughs> Moa. But that's all right. Because it's a memorial. They stole the damn thing. Took it to England in 68. They're using it, made it commercial. So nothing to stop me from making it commercial their way. Turn around on them, the memorials, the carvings in the, in the Marae, right on the other side, guess where they come from. See, they're using the memorials, lock them up in the museum or lock them up in the Marae, then got your mother, got you. See? So I said, that might, that might, that might. Stand there and the Seneca Trust and say, I'm here to claim what's mine. And I want you to tell me, if you can't say anything, <laughs> oh, that, that's what I wanted to say today, but my 10 minutes didn't even get to 3 minutes. <laughs> I'm used to 10 minutes, I'll get down to 2 minutes, I'll be pretty quick on it. <laughs> but I, I'm just passionate about you fellas making a move. I think it's the right time. <laughs> Always at night time. Any <laughs> night time, Good. it's the time to make decisions, because that's when I'm up at 3 in the morning. Thinking, well, oh, by myself. Thinking, who the hell am I going to talk to at this time of night? You know who's awake? The British are awake. They said, John, tell your people, hurry up. They're waiting over there in Westminster. They're waiting because they know the Westminster Magistrate Court equals the Titi Morai Magistrate Court. Same thing. Two party contract. Nobody can inquire. Private. Nobody's business. That's how it works, uh, everybody. That's how it works. If we know what to do with a contract, play the contract, you get all your money back, you get all your money back, you'll get everything and take it off somebody that's not playing our game of two contract, king, paramount, exactly the same. Exactly the same. That's why Mohi said they keep calling themselves something else, call yourself Maori, that's invented by the Crown of Wellington. Call yourself anything but that, you got a deal. Marry's all right, just, just leave the, the thing there, but deal with the commercial side from here on in. Anybody that's business minded knows how that works, and we do it. You know what I mean? We do it. That's my call from any bit of land. It's all equal, the same. You get one, you get one. I want you fellas to the Cook Street, that's my, my said, get into One Tree Hill, the Cornwall Park, that's the parliament. Commercial or Commonwealth, federal, state, governor of the world. That collects straight. They can't stop you in Westminster because that's part of that. That's why they went for One Tree Hill. They put that memorial up there. That guy's supposed to be the, the uh, Prime Minister of New Zealand. They have a Logan Cabinet. They made sure to squash that Moriori Manukau title at the heads of the Manukau. I've got everything. I've got everything you want. You can have it back, but it'd be a Big long one on class to learn all that lot. Better just shortcut that lot, take my word, and that's it. Use it. Or lose it. See, that's what I say. Look, use it or lose it. But we, we, we are being watched. We are being watched by the Freemasons because they run the world with this title and that flag. They are the ones that put all the instruments together in Asia. <coughs> that's why Prince uh, Philip is guarding for their family and nobody else. You see, they're using your mana to mirror themselves right through all the other countries they're conquering. I, I kid you not, they are doing that to all the other natives of waking up that their marriage are suddenly found. They're the answer that's been holding up the whole world. Right? We, we have a big stake in it. We have a big stake. We don't have to try too hard. What we have to do is follow that. I think you've already know what to do. We all have our parts. I'm, I'm going to head on the bank, the Moai Powerhouse Bank. That's your Moai. It's a Tahitian memorial. They took the memorials and locked them all up in a museum in London. In France, it's in there. It's in New York with King Winner. They put the, put the Moai there. You, that's you, the Tahitian. Right? The Cook Island is the other one. Uh, uh, title. Those two, the Moriori was a country called Riku. This Chatham was another country. The British knew what to do. 
with those titles. That's why they hid it. They hid that title of Reku away with Raki and our Raki, South Island, as Nazi Pro started that racket off from, from uh, uh, East Cape to South Island and took them over and the bridge because the parkheads were already there. And so they claimed that as their title. Now, the Paramount goes, hang on, hang on, hang on. Where the hell do you get that from? You see? So we always go, this is nothing to do with fuck papa. This is just to do with commerce. Who picked what? Who said what? Who put their little bits of paper on the land to make money out? So that's all I'm saying. I'm saying we have all the, the what you need here with us. Oh, uh, everything I do is online. The whole world is watching. Why well, don't you, well, you people reading this stuff? There's some videos. Why aren't they looking at it? We, we know. We know. And, uh, oh, well, well, just leave me out and come by yourself. <coughs> no, 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 it doesn't work like that. I, I've got to go and make sure they know what we're going to do. Because they'll single me out and say, well, who's benefit? You're going for who, Who's benefit? Uh, oh, all the people as well. You see? The Queen's people, no, the King's people. Who the hell owns this land? The King or the Queen? Who the hell made the documents? The King or the Queen? It was the King that conquered everything, not the Queen. She just administered what the King did. So he called himself King. And claimed the whole plan. No! You see? And it worked, it worked. Nobody said anything. Nobody said, take that head off your head. Take my picture off you. Because you're, 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 you're insinuating that I'm a crook. To John Key or anybody, because I am. I'm making fools out of them online and I'm using the media because it doesn't cost me. I don't have no money anyway to pay for it. But I'm saying it's effective, it's hitting the right places. So, Bundy, I, I applaud you for, for making the effort to open the grand jury court because it's live, it's effective, and people are waiting for it to spring out and force. A piece of land. I want uh, the Cook Street with your 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 backing because that all belongs here. We just need one piece of land and equals the whole. Right through the world. It's the same Queen's title, six six million acres here, and all the rest of it around the world that's affected by this title. Alright? I'm saying it's affected by this blueprint because the Queen's hiding her business in that Mara and Yarasai. With that ship, the British ship, Admiralty, that they fly our flag going <coughs> down again. But they're using it for its uh, 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 inheritance or its king to king to king. From King uh, Solomon to uh, William the Conqueror to King William III, he created the Bank of England and the Pound Note. To King William IV, he created the Stock Exchange between 1820 and 1830. And then he became king for seven years, he implemented it, and the Rothschild stole it. You have two factions now that are trying to claim the world, the, the Rothschilds and the Queen on this side, and uh, the, the Freemasons on this side, and, and Mounds on this side. That one, this one. Which one do you want? This one or this one? You see? You stay with the Queen, it's full of debt. You stay with this one, it's full of credit. Come. Not quite yet. Don't be right to town, no doubt. That's, everybody's seen that now. Uh, I'm physically doing something online and making use of the publicity that more people will believe it. I'll tell you what, it's building pro progressively. Yeah, that, that, that's all I need to say. Uh, are you on apartheid? Yeah, yeah, apartheid. Just apartheid. Yeah. Oh, well, what are you yeah. just, we've got the weekend, uh, and for my simple mind, because it is simple, <laughs> You're delivering a lot of information. I'd love you to to actually walk us through physically, not not now, yeah. but you know, over the weekend, physically on the whiteboard. Just show those yeah. stages so we can see that fucker papa, and then beside it we can see how it actually works. Because yeah. for me, I'm visual. Yeah. I'm getting the quarter all, but for me, I'm visual. When I see it up there, I'm going to go. Bing. Yeah. And I'm sure a lot of us will get that. Are you, are you happy? Yeah, to yeah, that yeah, yeah. That's what I'm here for. I'm here for the duration. Uh, so, so on, you must get through it. I'll give as much as I can. It's, I've already made the notes so that it quickens up things. And I just need a, a scribe to, to make my, my little spiel so I can stick on track and otherwise go off. But 
there's plenty too much. There's too much to absorb in, in one weekend with this sort of thing. Especially the latest. I'll tell you the latest. Theresa May has just got the DUP party, the, 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 Irish. the Irish party, and paid a billion dollars uh, 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 for them to prop her up. She's short of votes, 326 votes. This is a true story. And she, the, the Northern Ireland Sinn Féin was thinking he would get the money, but no, they gave it to Bel Belfast. Belfast is going to administer the money, and they gave the nine, um, um, nine MPs a, a hundred million each for two years. But because they gave it to Belfast, that's where the eight-point star of St. Patrick is on our flag. And they've done that on purpose because I can tell you what's adding up here. The King William III and the Pound Note and the Bank of England, they're trying to wrestle it with this Waitangi Marae, with what's going on with Peter Peroni and Jerry Mataparai as the... the uh, you know, Jerry... No, I'll, I'll just Let's see. Let's see. Why is that late? We're in a meeting. We're in a meeting right now. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> all right, good, good, good. It's all very good. Yeah, I'm busy. Oh, oh, oh. Eh? I'm on my feet. Talking. I'm, 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 I'm spellbound people. Uh, uh, I'm just telling them the good news about you all. Yeah. I'll tell you how early, buddy. You believe me that? You may be here. Yeah. <coughs> okay, Kingy. I'll carry on. I'll talk to you later, eh? Yeah, yeah. No, he's going right. Because I'm still on my feet. I'm going to get back to talk. Okay? Yeah. So, uh, I'm saying there's a pattern happening here, Peter Winnie. There's a pattern of evil happening right in front of us about that flag and that chip on the other side and that marae, a, a grand jury court we opened up, right, and brought it on this side from Okiata. We've got that pattern and they're running for cover underneath somebody's umbrella or petticoat, Pita Peroni's petticoat, mm -hmm. and the trustees are going to run there and team up against the onslaught of this buoy here. And I'm just coming here to ready it for a nice battle of lethal paperwork that they won't bat an eyelid. They can't say anything. They can't say anything, Bundy. They cannot say anything because it's quite true. Ah. <coughs> <coughs> We've got to quit the trusty business. Uh, There's only one any funny. Not the trustees. Oh, one thing, I yeah, see, yeah, I, I don't know. But thanks for correcting me. Because I, 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 it was their who, and I wasn't going to say anything out of place there. Because I, I know, I know the signals are right for everybody. Not just picking on one or the other, but they've got their jobs to do for the land to protect it. Because I tell you what, the new world order is just about to step in. And the Freemasons are watching me. My head gets blown off if I tell anybody their secret bank secret. So I'm being not uh, frightened, not frightened, because as long as you know, somebody else, everybody knows sure. in the whole world. Yeah, sure. So I don't hide any facts or things because you own it. You've got to own it. If I'm not there, just to let you know that somebody's always got that story. I mean. That's why the documents have gone out, because it'll only come from here of the author and the instigators of that native title. Mm -hmm. It comes from here. Look here, if anyone's standing up at the moment that is, looks to me, on the face of it, doing something that will be effective against the Crown, not picking on other haku, but it, it's what I've seen over the years. Over 20 years I've watched from one to the other, right in the Confederation, right to the Confederation, kick on our law society, the whole law, to end up on Maui, a memorial that is effective to use something that they've stolen back on them. And, and that's what I'm saying. Stand on your feet and claim that what's yours. 
because it will return everything, including the flag. However you use it, it's, it's got its uh, uh, title wrapped up in a bank. It's a bank trading flag and we'll treat it as a bank trading flag to claw back everything stolen right in front of us. It means making everyone accountable for every square metre of the land and to apportion the land and value the whole up. That's what we're doing with Cook Street. Uh, because they're, they're, they're on the rocks with that one. Yeah, up there. Thank you, Mr. All that quarter roof, as Danny was saying, a few days in to put it on, on the board yeah, so yeah, we can all see it. Yeah. And because uh, you can mumble all yeah. day, we'll, we'll, we'll only catch up. Yeah, yeah. Fair. So if you put it on, on, on the board there, we can all see it. We can Car take what Car we want, right? Yeah. And take what, but what I'm going to do over the weekend is put on the board what's working for us yeah. in the Portuguese. Yeah, cool. So that's all I'm going to do. Yeah. Thank you very much for your thing. Mm -hmm. uh, so, so, John, don't. I uh, just want to ask one question. So, what do you want from this story? What do I want from this story? For you to proceed with what you're doing. To take action with the with the, the, the paramounts that I've been writing about. Correct. And to, to make uh, the contract work from a native um, point of view, as being a group of people. Just it off. I've picking I picked up one piece of land. No, no stop. What do you want us, it's good. It's good. these people in this room, mm. to consider to support you by the end of the weekend? Uh, you, what do you want them to say? Yes, John, go ahead, start tomorrow. All, all, what, do you, all, what do you what do you want from all, this all I want to do is to get support from this group and the Tomata Komatua of Hokiana to support what I'm doing to go to Westminster. And if you get that support by the end of the weekend, when are you going to start? I'm going straight away and seize Cook Street with these documents and seize it and make it effective work this time. They arrested me and they squashed the case and didn't let me have my court case. We have been our court case. Alright. So, I, I just need to know that. So that while we're sitting there, because I'm really not I'm interested, John, but I really don't want to pay. I'm listening, so I don't want you to continue elaborating. I just want to know what these people have got to consider throughout the duration of this. Yeah, so all I'm talking about is land and the commercial theft of land. I look for them to allow me to go ahead and do something with that, those titles. Can, can I just say something? Okay. I think that. Uh, be good so that we can be well informed and then make a decision from here, you know, because this is not an overnight thing. I've, I've been following this for a few years now, and it's not something you can just click on to. So uh, I think we should give them a chance and then let everyone in their own right decide from there. And that's where you put that forward, whether we should support you. But it's been well informed first. There's a few people that don't know this stuff. This is just my fucker. Sure. I'm quite willing to do that. Instead of putting a stop on it straight away? No, no one's putting, no one's putting, putting a stop on it. Yes. What we're saying is that there are specialised people in this room that have specific things that they know they do and they do it well. Documents. It's documents, legal documents. You've got to know everything about the Freemasons. That's right, correct. But what I'm saying is. That's not going to be learned by this bunch in Wanwana. No, no. Because you've Too got much. Nelson, Too much. you've got myself, and you've got others that have uh, strategies which collectively will make an impact. So, John, I support you. Yeah, it's too much in one night. No, one no, day. no, I'm just saying I support you. Thank you, thank you, Carla. And I'm, and I'm not needing a collective to tell you to go ahead. Yeah, no. On my behalf and on my couple. Yeah, that's right. So I'm just saying you have my support yeah. and I just want you to start. Yeah. And I don't need to go from the beginning of one, one wānanga <coughs> to the end. I have the mana to tell you 
that you can go on behalf of our hapi. And, and I'm actually interested to know which other ones will um, rise. But I, something that I've been working on is um, where are our children? Where are our children? Are they at school? Are we still sending them to school? We want to talk about. Um, we want to talk about taking over the government, but I want to know where your children are in your household. Are you still sending them into an unconstituted education system so that they can get continue to get brainwashed? Yeah. Where are they? What I did was I was a you know hapu hui here hapu hui there and I stopped. I said, Holy hell! What does my household look like? What does my immediate household look like? Where are my children? Oh, they were going to school because I was sending them to school. You see now they're all pulled out. I took them out of the system completely. Gave the New Zealand Police notice. You're not a uh, service provider for me. These children this household and these vehicles. You come up, you come into my <coughs> sovereign area. So now what I'm doing is I'm saying I'm in control of my my children. I know where they are and I know that I'm the one teaching them. Because if, if we're talking like we're talking now and yet with our kids are still at school getting dumbed down to be subservient little order takers because it's easier to actually send them to school from nine to three and then we wonder why they will they're not succeeding. So that's one of my questions. Where are our children and why us to consider that during uh, the duration of this period? Because I don't want to listen to anybody that's still sending their children into the system to be fucked over by an unconstituted system. I don't want to listen to anybody that hasn't even sorted their own household out. But what I'm saying to you, John, is I support you 100% go ahead. Whenever you're ready to start, I'm just saying that my whanau hapu um, under the waka meninga support you. <coughs> now I'm looking to listening to someone else that I can support on an international level. Um, I'm really not too interested in what's happening in the hapu. <coughs> when I come into a waka meninga um, hui, and I'm not saying it's an organisation, I'm saying it's an event, that I'm looking for strategic strategy and critical thinking on a national, on an international basis, not a national basis. And you present it on an international basis, and I appreciate that. The time is just like to tell you a story about what happened back in uh, 2005. <coughs> Mohi Manakawa rang me. He said, Bill, I'm sending someone over to see you. 